I'm tired of the shootings, I'm tired of the, the killings, um, and I'm going to do something about it. Plus, gun violence not only affecting downtown Milwaukee, but the entire city. And that is our big story tonight at night, a pledge for change. A community activist is joining with mothers of homicide victims going door to door with one request. They are asking families and entire neighborhood to watch after their own to stop the violence. Our Sam Kramer joins us live now from Milwaukee Police Headquarters with more on their message. Yeah, hi there, Steph. Mayor Cavalier Johnson and Police Chief Jeffrey Norman said it here yesterday. The city's gun violence problem isn't just happening downtown. They want to address it at the local neighborhood level. Well, that's exactly what this group of people tried to do tonight, hoping some face-to-face -face conversation will actually make a difference. Well, the people that do live here, can, can you get this to them? On doorsteps and sidewalks near 49th in Hampton, Tracy Dent carries flyers and a message for public safety. It means more to people if you go door to door and talk to them. The community activist isn't running for office or asking for votes. Instead, Dent sees another opportunity. He's knocking on doors, hoping conversation can spur change. It's saying, I am tired of of the reckless driving that's going on in my um, in my block in my neighborhood. I'm tired of the shootings. I'm tired of the the killings, um, and I'm going to do something about it. Dented a handful of volunteers crisscrossed this neighborhood Wednesday night, where just a block away, two teens were shot and killed earlier this month. It just broke my heart, and it's like enough is enough. We got We got to do something. Shannon Allen felt a similar call to action because for her. This walk is personal. My world changed drastically that day. Each step she takes in person she meets is another chance at closure. Her son DeAndre was shot and killed more than six years ago. Now she's hoping a community pledge to end the violence will keep another family from feeling her pain. We don't get a chance to heal. Um, when this violence continues, continues, it continues to open up that wound that we are already suffering because we don't have justice. We don't have the answers that we're looking for for ours. Now, Dent tells me he plans to keep doing these walks in neighborhoods really across the city, and he's hoping that Milwaukee police, other elected officials will join too. We're live tonight in Milwaukee. Sam Kramer. Fox 6 News. All right, Sam, thank you.